Hello and Darla. We're on our way to Vanderwater Conservation Area, which is about an hour from Kingston, about 30 minutes north of Belleville, about two hours from Toronto. It's an absolutely beautiful conservation area. We've gone here a few times, really, really enjoyed it. Uh, you can expect to see you know, lots of beautiful forests and trails, and it's right beside the Moira River. Uh, it has about 16 kilometers of hiking trails you can explore too, so. Stop in Belleville and we stopped at a cafe we really like. And I got Benji's. Oh, Benji's okay. in Belleville. And I'm trying to get a Belgian waffle sandwich. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You tried that? Look forward to that. Sorry for this. Christine got an oat fudge bar. And then we got a couple of cappuccinos. So even though I'm retired after this trip, I may have to go back to work. <laughs> she will help pay for her snacks. We have a bit of a cafe addiction. We enjoy good quality coffee and good snacks. Right, Darla? Hey, Bruno. So we just made it to the trailhead. It's a nice big trailhead here. There's a map of all the trails. Like I said, it's around 16 kilometers of trails you can get here. Um, really, really nice. Although the mosquitoes are starting to circle already. I wish us luck. Trails well marked with colors. When you get to the entrance, you can split and go three ways, but there's a map right at the start, so you can take a look at that. Outhouses are nice and clean, by the way. Beautiful tall trees to start. So we were saying this is our first t-shirt uh, day. First t-shirt day of the season. Sun's out, guns out. Yeah, right. I gave him a little gun show there. Nice little mossy fence. Dogs are very happy after being in the uh look at that grace very happy after being in the car for a couple hours there's a few steep hills in here but it's certainly not really long but heart rate going up a little bit well, it is spring after all. Let's see if I can get across it without going in the mud. The trilliums are just starting to pop. What's that, Darla? What's that? Christine and I walked this trail probably for the first time around five years ago. We've been together almost five years. I'm not quite sure how we found out about that. I think Christine, everywhere she goes, she is searching trails to go. So I think she probably found it. And living in Prince Edward County, it's a pretty easy day trip to get here. So we came here a little bit blown away by it because we're used to really nice hikes in Kingston and Prince Edward County, but this one is really nice. It's quiet. Today's a weekday, so there's like two cars in the parking lot, so it's really quiet.
beautiful limestone slabs. Can you please have a picnic? Mr. Wuss himself, ladies and gentlemen, prepare for the big moment. He's actually going to dip his toe in the water. He might even put his whole foot in. Wait for it. There you go. Good job, mister. Really pretty down here with the trees lined on both sides. Couldn't have got a better day for it. And they're into the mud. This is just off the main road. It's just absolutely beautiful. We love these deep woods, trails and paths. All the pine needles on the floor. Charlie always has to collect every stick that's in the water. She's got two. Tell she's fighting a little bit against some current or yeah, something. Yeah, a little bit. Good she's job, Darla. Good girl, Darla. Pretty this mossy old fence along this part of the trail. And there is our hike of Vanderwater Conservation Area, almost six kilometers. Um, really, really enjoyed it. We've done again a fairly similar hike before. You could do a lot more if you want to spend the day here and do more kilometers, but today that was really nice. Uh, a little bit of up and down because you saw the dogs got to get in the water and have a swim. And one of our favorite hikes, I'd like to say, on the way back, I was commenting about how we kind of judge trails by their feel and like their energy and whatnot. How would you rate this one? Um, this one felt really magical and realmy. <laughs> <laughs> I really liked it, but if you're going to come and you're going to pay the six dollars to get in, take advantage and plan to spend a few hours here or Tons of people come pack a picnic and head out to all the flat rocks where the water was flowing on top of it where the dogs are. Lots of people come with their kids, pack yeah. a picnic, and they go swimming there, but wear water shoes. Uh, certainly really, really pretty. I love how you go for sort of the one start. You're really into the nice deep woods and really diverse and up and down and pretty. Then you kind of get to finish off some water views. So. Yeah. Hope you enjoyed that. If you get the chance, make sure you get here. It's certainly one of our top hikes in eastern Ontario that we like to do. Take care. Bye. Bye.